What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we'll be looking at a brand new map for Skaterx that came out last week and already has over 3,000 downloads. So this one's definitely a must-have map, guys. I'll leave a link in the description to this map so you can download it right now and play it yourself on PC. Desert Heights by DH13. It's like a downtown city plaza map and it has a really unique feature to it that I want to show off to you guys really quickly because I think this feature should be something that easy day adds to the game. I know they don't really do many updates very often, but I want to make a case here, okay? I've been saying this for a long time. I think this feature that this map has is one of the best features that I've ever seen in a, a map ever. And this feature needs to come to the actual core game. Day and night. And this map's actually on a timer as well, so this will happen automatically even if you don't click this. But if you want to click it, you can change the time of day into nighttime. So let me do that really quick. Boom. I would even love to have like a maybe like an evening toggle button too, just to add some more options and stuff. Nice little circle edge right here. It's got like a front tail slide, maybe front 270 out. And then, whoa! <laughs> I just made the hop in the bank. Whoa. Oh, and it just turned to nighttime. I'm not sure how long the timer is, probably like five, 10 minutes, but every so often the map will automatically change to nighttime. Hop over this. Uh, like I can't even see my character really. So what we should do, I guess, is add a little light on my camera. And by the way, guys, I have new stats and settings for today's gameplay. So if you wanna grab my stats for from this video right here, hop in my Discord down below. And I have all my XXL settings, my bone settings, my stance and stuff in my Discord down below. Flat ground impossible. That's an example of one of the tricks I have made for my stats. Ollie over that. Hit my bum. Uh, oh, damn. One of the fortunate problems about this build of the game that I'm playing, like this is the public Steam version. Um, I don't have a light on my camera for filming stuff. I could have it in my gameplay, but I can't actually film with the light right now. The mod is kind of broken a little bit. Oh, the front's feeble on that. Very nice. So maybe I'll switch to the daytime so we can get actually get some clips today. Nice tray flip and then Nolly heel nose grind. Oh! For some reason when I filmed it, I lost my pop sound. Let's get like all the 360s going. Back three. Uh, front three. Ooh, that was cool. Nolly flip a flat. Turn around for like a Nolly backside. I always love how these look. Nolly backside. Let's go like Nolly cab. Uh, damn. Man, this spot right here is crazy. This is like a perfect gap over the staircase. The attention to detail on this map is really sick too. Like this rail was taken out and you place it on the ground over here. Like something, somebody pulled it out of the ground. Back foot catch. Got that one. Ooh. Oh, an right heel. That was all right looking. Let's go backside kickflip. Oh, that was nice. Wow, switch front one up. And then we'll hit the set. Frontside flip. Damn. All right, we're going to do a switch heel flip. And then... Oh, that was nice. And we'll film that. Let him roll up, roll up, roll up. Oh, switch to nighttime. So we're back in night. I wonder if I can hit this at night. I got to turn my light back on for this, though. Can't really see. Kick flip back tail, and then back 50, 50 the rail. Oh, it's pretty far out there. Crooks, I can't see it. Circle ledges and anything that's curved in this game is always super tough in this game because it doesn't grind itself. You gotta also turn your character the entire time to get out of it properly. So, no slide. I might make it. It's a lot of wax. 50, 50 is the hardest trick in any single rail in the game. And around like a double curve rail, like, are you kidding me? Uh, <laughs> dude. I'm going to press up and down on my sticks when I do 50-50 because that'll keep me flat and I'm going to use my sticks to kind of maneuver around the rail as I'm in it because like if you're on a rail you can turn your body with your sticks so I'm going to use my sticks and my triggers to get around this thing kick the crooks up and down and then kind of curve around it oh that was close I don't think we can count that one though Nice, nice. Here we go. That's the one. Finally got it. It took like a good 15 minutes to do that. I haven't skated over here. There's not really much difference between this side of the map and the other side. Like, same ledges, same benches. So not much going on over here. This is cool, though. Oh. Let's 
Oh, what? Okay. There's a lot of these like pizza Dorito ledges. Like a lot of, lot of triangle ledges. Different ways to hit them, but I don't know how I should do this. Oh, this is really cool. I like this a lot right here. A ledge to this rail. And I think what we could do on this is late shove it and stuff. It's a very low light rail for this. Oh. We could probably get it better than that. Let's do a couple more. We could do kickflip back tail shove. Got to land perfectly straight though or else I lose all my speed for this. So, boom. Oh, with a pop on that one. Ah. Oh, I think that was sick. That was good. Oh, it's, it switched to nighttime during my clip. No, I don't think I could have a light on my camera either. Uh, it's weird because like the light on camera is over where I spawned. It doesn't really work. Let's go over here and then switch to daytime again. And then I can go to my replay editor and then I can get the clip. Not bad. I always love a good handrail session. So let's get some good tricks on this thing right here. Back porch slide. Very nice. Let's go kick flip back a lip. Flippy Smithy. Ooh. Kick flip. Oh, we can really dip this a bit. Oh, that was nice. Front side Smith with the kick flip. Uh, that was a bit weird. Like that. That's all right. This is a Sora Shirai trick right here. I don't know how he does this every try in real life, but apparently this is a realistic trick. A cab tail slide. Big flip out or big spin out. Let's do like half cab back smith. Oh, that was sick. You just, you can roll into these like quarter pipes and just cruise them. Really sick. No, the heels. Blunt shove. Oh. Nice and possible up there. That was sick. Blunt shove again. Whoa. Oh! Oh, look at these kink rails on this side. Never skated these. Kick flip back crook. That was decent. Oh, that was clean. Holy. I can, like, low pop onto the top one for no slide. Torque it up. Tail slide? That's like perfect for my stats. Switch no slide. Flip out. That was nice. Let's get a 50180 for finish it off here. Nice. Wow. And then we'll try like half cab with the front one out. Ah, sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. I don't like the power slide sound. Try it again. Damn. Don't want a power slide at all. No! Eh, that's alright. What? Big long hand drill over here. Uh, a little bit quicker for this rail, I guess. Oh yeah, by the way, guys, all my clothing that I'm wearing today, I'll leave a link down below. They're mainly all XLGM clothing. I've got like a Carhartt hat, LA shirt, dynamic Dickies pants that actually move in the wind. Last Resort shoes. I know you guys like the Last Resorts a lot. And I got some Nike socks too. Just rubbing my head on the wall. <laughs> oh, just a 50 50 cross lock. This would be nice. So, left side on the back truck, right side on the front truck for this one. I can even go heel side too. Like, front 50s in real life, I usually do heel side, honestly. But in this game, it's a little bit like lean to the side. So, I like to do cross locks better. So, hop on. That's really good. That's nice. And see how it like, kind of like, balances the board out better? Let's 
All right, I'm gonna go in on this handrail right here. Whoa! Nice, impossible. Two semi nose blunt. Whoa! That was pretty sick. Damn! Oh, I switched to nighttime midline. This is so cool looking at night though. I need the light on my camera now. Back sugar cane. That was nice. Let's go back hurricane now. Let's do all the all the canes. Oh, got a weird bump out on that one. Weird uh sound. Oop. Missed the landing on that one. Uh, it's a bit better. We can get this perfect low. Get it way better than this. I never do front side sugar cane though, so I don't know how this is gonna look. It's all right. We can get a front hurricane really nice though. Better than that one. Sugar cane. Hey, favorite one of all time is the front hurricanes. Front Hurricane Fakey, Front Hurricane Regs. Ooh. Damn. Alright, this is a Yuto Horigome type trick. Nolly back one, blind side, to a switch front side Smith Cram. Like, it's crazy how he can do it in real life first try, and I can't do it in the game. Not even close to first try. It's crazy, like, saying real life now is like video game skateboarding when, honestly, skateboarding has surpassed video game skateboarding. These guys are landing tricks first try that I can't do in a video game. I kinda got it. Oh, that was a good one. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did like it, make sure to leave like and subscribe down below. Every single like subscription does help on my channel. I don't really push that too often because I just like to make good videos for you guys. But if you guys do that, it helps me out a ton, guys. It gets more views in my videos and reaches more people and more people subscribe and follow Skater XL and jump into the game. And, and overall, it's just good for the game to help get more players into this game and stuff. I know we're all kind of salty about Easy Day Studios and not getting frequent updates and stuff that we thought we would have had since the release and stuff. But honestly, guys, this community has been keeping this game pushing for so long, for so many years. I have to really respect every great map and every piece of mod or gear that we get in the game because... Oh, I just switched to daytime. The modders in this game really keep this game going, and I really do appreciate all the stuff that we do get. If you guys want to get into this game and, you know, start making mods, maps, or edits and stuff, definitely share those with me, either on my Twitch stream or even in my Discord down below. We're always looking at brand new edits and new mods and maps on my Twitch channel, so definitely Hop into Twitch as well and join us there. We're always playing together in public lobbies, looking at new stuff. Anyways, guys, hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video. Later.